Joining us now is Jane Cowan, who is in Ferguson. Certainly authorities here are saying that they expect things to get worse before they get better. Uh, this has become a nightly ritual now. But down a narrow space between buildings, it's a different world. The sewer has become a play pit. The children are irrepressible and ordinary life goes on amid the filth. These people are angry because the river has overflowed onto the floodplain where they were living, washing away their homes. All their responses to each new problem that arises are very calm, almost dismissive, and that in itself, as much as the problems, is causing an outcry in the Indian media because there just doesn't seem to be any sense of accountability. California's preparing to launch America's biggest carbon market. The world's largest economy and second largest just a meter of greenhouse gases still has no national plan to deal with the problem. Texas! But the question is, are Americans ready to contemplate sending another swaggering Texan to the White House? It's a tall order though for Mitt Romney to best Barack Obama on foreign policy, isn't it? When he can point to so many achievements like the raid that killed Osama bin Laden. Name another one. Ending the war in Iraq, which was a, a Iraq campaign is promise. Unraveling Al Qaeda is on a, uh, making a strong comeback. It's not just small remote communities that are at risk. By the most pessimistic predictions, there'll be so much subsidence of land and sea level rise in the next 100 years that New Orleans will become an island. There's an undeniable loss of confidence in the CFA under the leadership of Fire Chief Russell Rees. Does the CFA need a change of leader? to get a fresh start? Well, again, um, I've made my views um, clear. People who've been involved in this inquiry are asking, well, if you're going to consult now for just two or three weeks, what have we spent the last 18 months doing? If Black Saturday has shown anything, it's that waiting to see was a, a pretty fast way to get into trouble. So It's the qualification that I made that's very important. She is, though, Roz, up against some veteran actresses in Meryl Streep and Judi Dench. So we've come back to the house where the surrogate women were living. It's all locked up. The neighbours are saying they notice strange goings on here, lots of women coming and going, but they were too concerned about their own safety to get involved. Beneath the surface, it's breathtaking. Maybe if it's a male, we'll go for more than three meters. 